We're going on now. A ball break, ball break. walking hand in hand in the moonlight. In the moonlight. We'll be the sweet soul there. I swear we'll never part. We're going on now. A ball break, ball break. running in the sand, feeling alright. Feeling alright. And when you fall into my arms, I'll break into your heart. Guys, it is Thursday, which means it's time for another video. I actually didn't get a chance to um, do some of the other reviews, and I was looking at some of my previous comments, and somebody did mention to review Damien Omen 2, and I was considering doing the whole franchise, but nobody in the comments really seemed, or nobody really commented really wanting that so since um somebody did request to review Damien Omen 2 I figured I would review it because I just recently re-watched it because it's been a while probably the last time I ever really saw it fully was on AMC back in the day when I was very young but yeah Damien Omen 2 um this takes place when Damien, the son of the Antichrist, is a 13-year-old kid. And he starts to figure out slowly that he is the son of the Antichrist. And when he finds out, um, shit goes down a lot. Everything around him. As you can see um, in this um, Blu-ray, um, it is a crow. And the crow kind of symbolizes death. Kind of like how the Rottweiler in the first one symbolized death. Because, for example, in the beginning, or in the original, the nanny sees the Rottweiler, then hangs herself. And it's basically a bad omen, no pun intended. But I, I really like this movie, honestly. This is a decent sequel. And I completely forgot... Or just never really realized that Lance Hendrickson is in this movie. And after reading on Tubi, supposedly he was kind of like embarrassed in a way to be in this. Because when it did come out, it kind of bombed a little bit. But I personally think that this is a pretty good sequel. Um, there's some not... Some of the deaths aren't as memorable as the ones in... Um, the original, like, the head decapitation scene or the, uh, pole going through the priest. Um, but there's some really decent ones, too. Like, when the one girl, as you can see in the back, she gets attacked by the crow. Because she kind of figures out that Damien is the, the son of the Antichrist. And... She gets attacked by this crow, but it doesn't stop there. Like, she gets literally, like, her eyes are pecked out. But then she gets hit by a fucking truck. Like, body flies in the air by the truck. Um, there was one towards the end where the, um, Damien's aunt, I, cause it's, she was part of the whole thing the whole time, and burns herself or gets no she doesn't burn herself she he Damien sets her on fire and it's just like so weird and kind of just random in a way given like how it went like so far and then she just they this payoff this um reveal that she was helping Damien the whole time or whatever but Damien killed it, it's so strange but Definitely give it a watch if you haven't seen Damien Omen 2. I do want to rewatch um the third I actually never seen the third one that I recall. I did see the fourth one many, many years ago, which is has nothing to do with Damien, and I've seen the remake maybe once when it like, first came out. So I definitely want to give those a watch. Maybe in the future I'll do just separate reviews of them. Just not a whole collection type thing. But this was requested, so I figured why not review it because I just recently watched it. But 
Damien Omen 2, definitely give it a watch if you haven't. I think it's a decent sequel, not as good as the original, of course, but it came it came out the same year as movies like Halloween, so you really think you really think this movie is gonna be as good as Halloween? No, but it's still a fun sequel. But yeah, that's really all I have to say. Comment down below and let me know what movies you guys want me to review next. I'm trying to review them as much as possible or get to your reviews as much as possible. But you guys did request a lot, so it's going to take a little bit because some of the movies that you guys requested I never actually watched. So, and I've been pretty busy this week, so it's been kind of hard to watch movies. But I will get to them as soon as I can. But in the meantime, I'll see you guys on Monday.